You play, play a little Michael Jackson, don't stop till you get enough. Not getting enough of the owl this morning. I'm hanging out with Kyler. We're talking about the hoot nanny. And if we were saying, if there was like an owl shuffle, like the Cleveland shuffle, it would be a hoot nanny hoedown. It would be a hoot nanny I mean, hoedown. We would love to have a hoot nanny hoedown. I'll talk to Brian about that. Maybe yeah, we can get, get a little, that, get that little dance thing up, going right? on. Well, this is, uh, you woke up to your colleague singing a song to you she this was, morning, yes. did she not? Yes, so this is a screech owl. Mm -hmm. This is Luna, our eastern screech owl. And they have a, a trill song that they do. So huh. that's how they get that name screech. It can kind of almost sound like a horse whinnying. It's kind of like a whistle. Interesting. So out of, out of a little horse is a big, you know, but right, little yeah. guy. Right, it, yeah. It's more in like the, the way her song comes out. So it's a Mm -hmm. Like a whistle, like a whinny, right? Gotcha. So That's we call good. it a, we call it a screech. Now uh, she is getting giving you a little attitude lately because it's getting yeah, close it's get, to it's getting mating cold. season. It's getting, it's getting close to mating uh -huh. season. Ah, okay. So she can get a little grumpy sometimes, mm -hmm. but. That's okay. We still love her. Now, during the season, what are some of the behaviors? Does she screech a little bit more? Let the let the males know she's around. So they'll or? they'll both sing. Okay. You can see those tufts, those ear tufts. Her yep. ears actually aren't on the top of her head; they're on the side of her head. Mm -hmm. But those ear tufts, um, they can communicate through those without communicating. Really, like a sonar? So so it's not like a sonar. It's more of of facial expressions oh, gotcha. for us. It's, it's uh, how okay. they express themselves. All right. So, so you can see that those would ear be tufts. a a little. A flirtatious wink, correct? But yes. with the tufts, yes. yes. That's how they wink and go. That's hey, right. I'm over here, big fella. Da, da, da. That's right. Ah. And you can see all that cryptic color she has. Mm -hmm. So she blends in really, really well into tree trunks. They're actually what we call secondary cavity nesters. Okay. So this owl um, doesn't dig its own hole in trees. It lets big woodpeckers, like our pileated woodpecker, build the hole. And then she'll take it over. And then she'll take it over when they're done using it. Gotcha. So gotcha. they come in two different color phases. Luna's our gray morph. And then we have another Eastern Screech Owl called Mars, and he's our red morph. So if there was a tree Zillow for animals, she'd be the best one because she, sure she would. <laughs> checks out all she the sure really would. cool holes. She so does, I'll yeah. Take she'll this one. she'll yeah. squint her eyes so you can barely even see her. She blends right into the bark. Gotcha. Now, when does the Hoot Nanny take place? The Owl Hoot Nanny is this Saturday, the 13th, mm -hmm. from 11 to 4 at North Chagrin Nature Center. Okay, and how many owls will people get a chance to. There will be observe? lots of different owls. So, Ohio School of Falconry will be visiting us oh, as cool. well as uh, our own Jeff Reby is doing a program as well on our live owls uh -huh. and there will be owls from all over the world it's wow. not just our native owls That's very we cool. will of course have our native owls but there of will course. be owls like the Eurasian and Siberian eagle owls no some way. of the biggest owls on the planet wow. and you'll get to see them the peregrine falcon oh, yeah. the barn owl all of them doing some flying, Harris's yeah. hawks, incredible birds from all over the world, and wow. you'll get to see them for free. That's the best part. That's really cool. Uh, uh, as we wrap up, out of curiosity, the wingspan of some of the bigger owls would it, would be how would it big? be about six feet? No way! Yep. Yep. Wow, that's a big so owl. So as big as I am tall. Wow, yeah. that's crazy. That's so awesome, Kyler. Thank you so much, and thank you, Diva, for <laughs> for being so nice and animated for us this morning. <laughs> that's so cool. All right, you guys, we're gonna go back to you, beautiful kids in the studio, because guess what? We're gonna talk about some more stuff you and the family can do during the winter months at your Cleveland Metro Parks. All right, back to you guys. All right, Kitty, thank you very much.